Your snoo is set up and you've snugged your baby in a sack. Zip the zipper all the way up and all the way to the bottom so the bands can't sneak up and get over your baby's mouth. Place your baby on the mattress with the feet closest to the power button. On both sides of the sack are wings with little elastic loops at the end. And on both sides of the sleeper are small safety clips. Slide the wing loops onto the clips. When used properly, you can rest easy that your baby will stay safely on their back all night long. For extra safety, Snoo won't work until you slide the wing loops onto the clips. No wonder Snoo is the safest baby bed ever made. Now turn Snoo on by simply pressing the button. The light will turn from white to purple, and Snoo will start the sound of rain and gentle rocking. After a few minutes, the rocking will slow and continue all night long. But if your baby cries, Snoo will quickly respond with stronger shushing and jiggling, almost like your very own personal night nurse. If the crying continues, Snoo will increase through four steps, increasing sound and motion until it reaches the level that works best to soothe your baby. Of course, Snoo is not a magic machine. When the crying goes on, despite a few minutes of sound and motion, it will automatically turn off. And that's the signal that your baby needs you. Perhaps some milk, a clean diaper, or a little sweet cuddle. You'll notice Snoo doesn't respond to mild fussing. But if your baby needs help, even if she's not crying, you can manually set Snoo to a higher level. Just press the button for a few seconds and the button will change color. Select the level that works best. And when you want to take your baby out, simply push the power button or slide a wing loop off the safety clip and Snoo will stop right away. There you have it. Welcome to the 21st century of parenting. Let Snoo help your baby and you have a safer, better sleep at the touch of a button.